Alrighty, everybody. Game two. If you guys can hear me, let me know. If not, if I need to talk up, just let me know as well. Tahoe here against 16 UGSC. Game two. Lucky to raise a tight match. Three to three. And you can hear Tahoe is looking to take it back. Dylan Taylor on the face off. He's going to go on his left and Garrett on his right. Garrett Pettison and Brady Wilson in the back. And Attila Kabata in goal. Brady Wilson tries to get it up and out. We'll see he's keeping the pressure down low. Sorry about the camera work, forgot about that. Yes, he dumps it in. And Tahoe will lose it. He's looking for the chest pass, it's not there. Things are low and offsides. Try to pretend he's going to shake it around a little tight pot here. You see, he dumps it in. Oliver takes a hit. Devlin Morgan shakes it out and dumps it in the case. Good floor check for Doug Tom Hook. Sends it across the mile. Tom keeps it in his own now, but he gets it out of his film and goes all the way down. Tom Hook regroups, Miles Eddie now. Same bye. I just got away with too many men left. Here we go, line one again. Dylan, Marco, and Garrett. With Aiden Papetti and Lauren Lem and Gek in the back. Lakers just sort of stay every weekend. I think it's a little rough, but the boys played really well. Uh, Everyone's got smiles on their face, so it's a good weekend up here. Hopefully, in the 60s, we'll finish this well. And GSE scores right off the glass. Two minutes in, those top corners near side. One's left. Two minutes in here. GSC is already up 1 0. And Tahoe goes outside.
The goalie for DSC tonight, uh, this afternoon, is Jonathan McGinn. And right now you got Dylan, Dylan Cole taking the face off the car. DSC wins it, pushing it down into the zone. And Braden Wilson's there to grab it up. Trying to get it out to Tahoe. Anything's wrong here, parents with the video, please let me know. This is Amy, so I can change it. Just let me know. Text me. Otherwise, nothing will change. Face off at some ice here. TLC with the win. And they'll dump and chase. Probably breaking it out now. Dustin. Probably should scoop it up to what win. Good stick by Miles Eddie. They play it out of that. Another fish up here at Center Ice. Dustin going to take it for Tahoe. And DSC wins. They try and get into the zone. Miles Eddie will pick up the puck. And go the way to DSC. Attila with a great love save right in front. Absolutely robbed DSC player. Killer is a true freshman playing 16 years, but is a stud for an amazing. Dustin in here will take the face off against the Tahoe. Devlin picks up the puck and will skate it out. Jumps and chases. And DSU will take back the puck. Devlin with a great four check. Almost kept it in the zone. Breath helped him out a little bit. And we'll check it out. Okay. We got Matthew Stamp, Dylan Powell, and Sebastian Gregor out there for Tahoe and forward. And Aiden Papay and Landon Gick on defense right now. Dylan wins the face off and flex it himself. Puts it back in his own zone, and he will regroup. He just needs to get out of there. Matthew gives it back to Aiden. Brings it in. Gets taken down, no call. And GSC breaks out on the 2 on 2. Drop pass down to 16. Braden Wilson with a good step up. Oh, big hit. Good defense there by Mr. Derek Peterson. Now Connor Hulgren wins that battle. And he'll take it down on three on two. Pass it across. Devlin misses it with his skate. And now the battle in the corner begins. TSC will break it out. And take it wide. Drop pass taken. Contested by Connor. And Dustin will get it out of his game. Again, if anybody can't hear me too well or the video isn't doing too great, just let me know. We can switch it up and try and change something. Thank you, Leo. Love to hear it. In the corner now, Derek fighting too. 
And Matthews takes it up. Dustin just got hit without the puck. And no penalty there. A little weird. They called it just about every hit yesterday for roughing. New York are happy there. Big rebound to Tiller with a great save, and the defense got it out of there. Miles now. Oh! Eddie now picks it up, and he'll skate it out himself. Get it up to the left, right here. Marco now battling here. Miles trying to fish it out. And GSC will recover it. And then it around really good. And they dump it in. And Oliver Owens is solo down to Tahoe. Marco now has an opportunity here. Takes it wide. Beats his defender. Great pass right in front. Dustin shoots. Score! Marco to Dustin. And Tahoe ties it one to one. Sorry if the camera is a little shaky there. Can't. Dustin's back in here to take the draw against GSE. GSE will win it and click it forward. Big bit by Dustin right here in front of us. And GSE dumps it in and gets it there. The turnout this weekend up here in Tahoe is absolutely amazing for every program 18 year, 16 year, and Lakers. We love you, Tahoe, and thank you so much for the support. GSC keeps it in the zone. He's taking it wide. Pass across. It's out loose still. A kill with a big save. And now the puck's behind the net. Just a recap on that goal. Dustin George scored. Marco Bulbian with the assist. Sorry if I got any of those last names wrong. Still haven't gotten the last names down. First names, I'm still struggling with. <laughs> Little tie up back there behind the net. Don't really know what's going on back there. GSE keeps it in though. Get the shot. Attila with a big save again. He's got it in there somewhere. And then Attila will get the puck for the tight top. 6 2 new this year. Looks really good. They uh, getting these scrimmages in against USC, getting warmed up for Colorado next weekend. And we're very excited for that. It's, Colorado's going to be a good time for these guys. Excited to see this team and what they can do this year. USC now keeps it in, takes a shot wide, and they'll recover it. Derek Patterson with a good hit. Still a blocks it wide with the blocker. And USC will keep it in still. Marco takes a block the shot. Out in front, Derek clears out the forwards, and Garrett Waterhouse will skate it out. Garrett Waterhouse skates past his defender. The Marco, oh, and he just missed the net. Sorry about the camera, guys. I keep forgetting. Been running around all day. I'm a little slow in the head right now. A little tired. Derek eats a shot as GSE brings it in. Braden tries to pin the forwards against the boards. See if he keeps control. And now Tahoe hopefully will get possession here. Braden plays the body instead of the puck. Gives it away and GSE misses the net. Derek, great defensive play there. Just shunned him from taking it out wide. 
Feels he almost just sniped that from the blue line. Tahoe's got to get it out here. Goes across. Attila with an amazing save. Sliding all the way across. Gets him with the blocker. Getting a little bit of extracurriculars here. Big 34 with a big stop there. Slid all the way across, got all the way across, and ate it to the bread basket. Braden. Braden and Liam Kishner here are getting matching minors for roughing. They're both going to be in the box right here for two minutes each. Take a little break. Let them cool their heads down a little bit. Referee is talking to one of the THA players. And now we'll get underway here as Paul tries to kill this penalty. Or sorry, we're five on five right now. Five on five, two matching minors. And we got a breakaway here for Connor. Connor Holgren. That's good back check by TSE. Got a little stick left in there. And Connor just couldn't get the shot away. You see he'll break it out here. And good clamp down by Oliver there at 81. Absolutely stood him up. Just kept the puck flat. Go Devlin with a big hit center ice. That's one kid on this team you don't want to run into. There's a couple of them, but that's definitely one of them. He's a big boy. And Miles Eddie's one of them too. Came out of nowhere. Surprised they're not calling that today. They were calling everything yesterday. And Dustin will just dump it in and get a line change here for Tahoe. Oh, they're going to call icing there. Icing on Tahoe. Nothing's changed there. They can still get a change. Still get the sub going. Once again, we got line one out here. Garrett, Dylan, and Marco with Derek and Aiden. The D line switch up here every so often. I believe we got five, so they got a double shift every once in a while. But they're killing it. The defense are doing really well here. Derek now will try and pick it up out of the corner. Marco's there to help. Dylan's. I'm working on getting it up. Hopefully, it's up and running again there, parents. Marco looking for a breakaway here. GSD will recover and keep possession of the puck. They'll dump it in, and Tahoe will hopefully get possession here. Derek, a little lazy back there behind the goal. TSE picks it up again. Brenny Monroe, old THA student. And then they score from the point. Attila didn't even see it. Shot from the point. Brenny Monroe passed it up to the point, 28. Sorry if there's any GSE parents watching. Ethan Abojo gets the goal. And GSE is up 2-1 here with 5.15 left to go in the first. As you can see, Mike is making sure that forward line knows and that the group knows that that puck shouldn't have even made it. Oliver tries to clear it out after two... THA wins the faceoff, but GSE will dump it in. Miles Eddy now will hit the boards and get it out. Matthew Stamp and Sebastian Bedore on the uh, four check. Dustin with a good pinch, gets the puck away. Matthew now gets a little puck from behind, and GSE will recover and bring it into the zone. Let's shoot it in until it'll drop and give it to uh, Oliver. Dustin now up to Seabass. And for any of you that don't know, Sebastian Gregor is Seabass, if I say that, sorry. 
Usually looking for the last names of the guys. Looks like GSE's getting a penalty here. Maybe matching. We'll see what uh, Mr. Alders has for us here. We just got GSE. Tiaho will be on the power play here for two minutes. We got a roughing call. Thank you for the like, everybody. And here we go. Tahoe's first power play opportunity of the game. We got Miles Eddy, Derek Peterson, Marco Bolbian, Dylan Cole, and Garrett Waterhouse out there. GSE wins the faceoff. Tries to clear it out, but Derek will keep it in. Right at the blue line, Miles down to Marco. Marco back up to Miles. Miles brings it across, back down to Marco. Marco looks in the middle. Dylan catches it, but gets swarmed by the GSE. Miles now gives it up. And GSE takes it away right away. They'll dump it in. Derek with the out of the air block. And Miles gets it up, and they can't connect their passes right now. Slow it down here a little bit, boys. Slow it down. There we go. Miles slows it down behind the net. And looking for the breakout. Derek now will skate it through. Sorry about this, this guy right here. You guys can't see the corner. GSE will clear it here and send it to the red line. Oliver will pick it up and regroup here for Kyle. Good hit there. Kind of took the puck away, so there's no call. Got the puck first. Sorry about the camera work there. And it goes up and out of play. Well, hopefully we see you guys in Colorado next weekend. The boys, I believe, head up there Thursday and play Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and come back Monday or Sunday night. Really good competition out there, and hopefully they can uh, come home with a positive record. Start the season off well. And now we're going back into the GSE zone here for the faceoff. They were up and out of play. Dustin's in there to take the draw. Wins it back. Dust, or sorry, Devlin with the immediate shot. And somehow a DC stick gets caught in Devlin's jersey there, and the GSC goalie will hold on. Mr. Jonathan McGinn is in net again for GSC. Dustin again gets tied up, and Devlin will chase on the forecheck. Aiden Perpetti keeps it in the zone. Gets it across. Devlin is back out to Derek. Derek with a shot blocked by number 21. And this will be an icing on GSE. I'm going to leave the camera right there because they're coming right back. Couple new rules this year for USA Hockey. Um, icing is on penalty kills as well now. And we also have a new hitting rule where they cannot hit any player as soon as they get rid of the puck. That's why if you get a roughing penalty now, it's, they're all over the place. Very easy to get a rough. Dylan's in there to take the draw. Gets tied up, but wins it. THA regroups, tries to throw it back around, got stuck on the back of the net. Aiden Papetti drops down. GSC with a good breakout. They're down a man. Sauce pass cross. Good stick there by Derek and Attila. Both of them got a little tiny piece of that was topped out. Derek's now in a battle here in the corner. Gets shoved in the back. Miles down there to help him. Aiden with a good stick. Matthew trying to get it out of the zone right here. And the door opens. Got the door to open. 
nice little easy stop for the play. Ref checking it if it's going to open again on him. That would have been really funny if he fell through the board. And we're going to be right outside the Tahoe zone here. As the play stopped right here, the faceoff will be here as well. Garrett's in to take this one with Marco on his right and Connor Hallgren on his left. Landon Gick is in the back with Mr. Eddie. Landon now will try and scoot it out and chip it out. Gets it on the half wall to Connor and Garrett will push it out of the zone. Miles going for a hit there. Marco trying to settle it down. And he will. This is a go. GSE takes it away. Get it out here, boys. There we go. Now we got Garrett taking it in one on one. Had a little help from Connor, but he wasn't quite in line in sight. I don't think Garrett's on. Devlin keeps that puck in. Landon with a little slash right there. You gotta watch that. Garrett with a good move. Gets tripped, no call. Miles is shot from the point. 45 seconds remaining in the period. Miles keeps it in. Trying to get it to Devlin. Miles walks across the blue line. Brings it down the corner, takes a shot, and it's saved by Mr. McGinn. Got to keep our heads on. Yeah. Uh, in his first period, so one left will get angry at us quick. And two, so the boys keep their heads on. Don't, don't get any stupid penalties. Dustin's in here to take the draw for Tahoe. Kind of wins it back to Devlin, but Devlin doesn't win his puck battle. Derek, a nice keep here on the red line. Sorry about that. A little just outside of camera view. Good step up there by Oliver. Just the puck got squeezed by him. Good shot and missed high. Devlin here on the forecheck. But GSE will keep possession as Matthew tries to keep it going, and that will be the end of the first period. At the end of the first, Tahoe 1, GSE 2. We will be back in about half a minute or a minute for the second period. Got a little guest coaching going on here from facing new head coach Chris Collins. Throwing up some kind of play here for the 16. Maybe trying to spark up a little creativity, get his uh, style of play in the game. Mike is here. This Chris is uh, more offensive minded. Kind of seems to get the get the puck in the net. Yeah, just has no poster. 18's uh, had one pair play this afternoon and absolutely capitalized on it as a head coach. And here we go. Second period about to start here in South Lake. My killer's still in goal for Tahoe. And McGinn is still in net for GSE. As the tap start, we got Connor Halden, Dustin George, and Devlin Morgan out there for Tahoe on the forward. And Oliver Owens and Derek Peterson on defense. 
Push start the period. The clock is not running. There's no time on it. And GSC scores through the screen. Killa again didn't even see it. Getting screened. They're taking away his eyes. The period technically didn't start. And now it says 1742. Period is only supposed to be 17 minutes. So that's a little odd. But GSE takes a 3 1 lead here. Just under a minute, or just under, yeah, just under 30 seconds into the period. Yep, they're going to play an 18 minute period here. Get a little extra game time in here as it's a scrimmage, not technically a real game. But we are treating it like a real game. Tahoe still tries to keep it in. Marco with a great keep in there. Gets his hand up, keeps it in, gives it to himself. Still trying to handle it himself. Gives it off the boards to Garrett, who takes a shot with an easy save to the breadbasket of the game. Again, as if anybody's joining us now, Tahoe is down right now, three to one. GSE just scored at the beginning of the second period. And if the audio or video cuts out at any point, please text me and let me know. It is a teacher scaring this. So my phone is available. I'm using my father's. So please text me, let me know if anything goes wrong or the audio is not loud enough. But GSE will get it out of the zone here. Aiden, or sorry, Miles Eddy will regroup and get it to Tahoe. And Devlin gives it back. And trying to slow down, gives it away in the middle of the ice, and Attila bails him out. I'm really sorry about the camera work, you guys. Devlin tried to bring it back into the zone. Skating backwards and then tried to scoop it up and out. Scooped it right into the chest of one of the players who just threw it down, shot it right into Attila's chest. We got Dustin in here to take the face off the Tahoe. Dustin technically wins that draw. We got Derek over here again. Someone's playing without a glove. Very scary. Derek, please grab your glove, buddy. Puck still behind the net. Derek, Derek is literally playing without a glove. In the corner there, you can see it. I don't know if he can actually do that. When I play the lacrosse, as soon as you dropped any piece of equipment, you had to go get it. And I was pretty sure I thought that was the rule for hockey too, but maybe not. GSE keeps it in the zone, takes a shot, and it goes wide. Derek regained his. A good shot block there by Matthew and Derek. Hit both of them on the way through. Oliver with a hard four check. Puck hits the glove, slows down a little bit. Kind of helps Tahoe out. They need to ice the puck here. This is where they struggled yesterday. There we go, Stampy. Stamp gets it up and out, and Tahoe will be able to get a line change here. GSC's pushing it fast, though. 13 King behind the defense. Shoots it high and wide. All the way up and out. Dylan picks it up. But the whistle was blown early. Dylan had a breakaway. And I believe GSE will be getting a penalty here for too many men on the ice. Ooh. I think he might have thought he touched it. So... The in-home or the coach's choice will serve this one. Number 93 for GSC. And Tahoe is going on the power play.
Face off will be to the right of McGinn. And Marco with a great forecheck. And Garrett's down there too. Gets pinned, but Dylan comes spring through. Little extracurricular activities there behind the net. And oh, good chance there for Garrett. Good pass there by Papetti. Dylan up to Papetti. Papetti gets pinned against the boards. GSC has a very aggressive power or penalty for side, excuse me. Dylan trying to settle it down. Papetti's there to help. And GSC tries to wrap it around, but Garrett is there, and he will keep it in the zone. He reverses it to Marco, who reverses it back to Garrett. Garrett behind the net, getting harassed, tries to go up to Papetti. Papetti was trying to come down to help him. Miles, though, will be able to easily regain this puck and reset for Tahoe. Miles takes a little step back, gives it back to Aiden. And Aiden gives it up to Garrett, who gets met by a GSC player. And Freddie Monroe takes it in. It's up right in front of Attila. And now behind the net. Miles looking for the outlet pass. Goes, tries to go to Marco, doesn't quite hit him. No call there. Marco almost got a tripping call. GSC again will clear it out. There'll be no icing here. Didn't make it all the way down. And Lane Geck takes it all the way in by himself. Gets a shot on net right into the chest. It was a good take. Good take from a defender. Way to get it into the zone and get a fuck. Get a get a freeze, sorry. Didn't mix some words up right there. Landon is wearing number 75. He is usually 84. Uh, figured we would use the old jerseys till the new one got here and put those babies to use in uh, Colorado. They're using the old purple and creams this weekend. GSC with a little cycle backwards behind the net and they'll pass it up and out. The tip, so there's no icing. Landon's in a race. Gets all the way behind the net, so there wasn't no real threat. Jesse still has control. We got about 12 minutes left. Period. 3 1 still, Jesse. And the wraparound goes in. Jesse with an easy goal. Just no backdoor coverage there for Tom. Pilla basically got left out to dry. Had to watch the puck go all the way around. Four to one GSC with eleven fifty four left. As you can hear, some GSC parents are here. Oliver now wins the or, sorry, Connor won the face up and Oliver dumps it in. Seabass on the forecheck. And again, Seabass to Sebastian for any parents that are joining us late. That's just the nickname he gave him. And I honestly, I don't think I've ever called him Sebastian. GSE breaks it out here. The captain, number 66, Addles. Dumps it in on net. Gets a rebound. And they score. No defensive coverage there from Tahoe. Kill to let the rebound out, and they pick up and finish it. Now five to one. With just over eleven minutes left to play here in the second, we will have, I believe, we will have an ice cut after this period. So we will take a little break and come back. But well, again, we do have a still uh, another eleven minutes here in this period. Dylan with the face-off win, but GSE picks it up. Aiden Papetti now goes cross right to Marco. Marco's all alone. Has help, but also has back checkers. Oh, getting a little jumpy here. Dylan's in the 
into scrum right here in the corner. Connor picks it up. Big shot. Good glove save. Try him again. Garrett on the four check. And now Aiden Bopetti will catch it out as GSE dumps it out. Garrett going hard on the four check. Oh, good, Leo. Thank you. Shot from the side. And easy save there from McGlynn. As you can see, Garrett is not happy. Garrett is one of the captains right now this year. Number 87. As of right now in the purple and cream. Trying to lead by example is he's one of the only two returners we have on the 16 new team this year. Eric Pedersen trying to get the boys going here a little bit. Getting the stick taps on the boards. Devlin with a shot. Hits the post. And it bounces all the way out past Miles. Unfortunate. Great shot there by Devlin. Great shot selection as well. Yeah, see it now. And they go offside. Devlin's very close there to getting his first goal for THA. Just barely missed it. May have, might have hit somebody in front and then hit the post. But as of now, still 5-1. to one. And Dustin's in here to take the draw. And Fior. TSC has the names on the back of their jerseys. Makes it a little easier on me. They're over on this side of the ice. Landon's getting a little happy here. Hit 13. Biggest kid on the ice. Getting a little motivated. Miles with a good pressure makes QSC dump it in. And now Mr. Geck will reset, gives it to Miles off his skate, and he'll give it to Dustin who skates it out. Dustin gets ripped or knee to knee there, no call. I think, uh, I think Mr. Albers is a little used to the junior rules from last game. But still, Tahoe has the Tahoe has the puck still in the GSE zone. The GSE will regain it and flick it out. Miles keeps it to himself. It's in his feet. He loses it. 93. Picks it up. Oh, close. Speed to kill a close side, and he hit the post and it rang out on the far side. And now Tahoe chips it out and trying to get a line change. These forwards have been out here for quite a mile. And Landon now again. Get some taps for a hit that the guy missed. TSC walks it in with the toe drag. Landon stops it. He will kill it with a good save. Connor trying to finish his hit. That's what I'm talking about, by the way, with that new rule. When they get rid of the puck, they cannot finish their hits. So that's why I'm just kind of surprised there haven't been a couple more penalties. Uh, I love it. I love the I love the physicality. I'll let them play, baby. Yes, he keeps it in. They keep it down below the goal. No real threat back there. Seabass absolutely took a run at that kid. Again, ref didn't call it, so they're letting him play. They're letting him play. And we got it about eight minutes left here now. GSE keeps it in. And Gonzalez now at the point. It's a tip in front. It's loose. And Tahoe tries to regain the puck. And Stamp here will ice the puck just to get the new legs out there for Tahoe. Smart play there by Stamp. Smart. Just get the puck out of the zone, get some fresh legs on. They got scored on like that yesterday. Couldn't quite get the puck out. Tried to chip it out and get an icing. And they sadly couldn't get it out, but that time they did. So we're learning. As long as we're learning. Dylan's in here to take the base off for Tahoe. Mr. Pedersen wraps it around in Raiden Wilson, or Connery Hallgren, sorry. Their numbers look the same. That's Garrett Waterhouse. Sorry, two names wrong. So Garrett's over here on the close side right here. Dylan and Marco. Good battle here by Marco going into the GSEN. 
And Oliver will step up here and keep it in. Get a shot, but it's blocked. Doesn't make it more than five feet. Now GSC Addles brings it up on a two-on-one. Attila with a good save. Underneath Derek, under on the other side of the goal. And Marco picks it up and brings it out for Paul. Marco walking around. That's laid out. A big hit. That was a good hit. Sorry there, guys. Giving me some of the A teams a little hard time. Get down here in front of me, eating chips. In their hoodie is all comfortable, not working. They did play this morning, though. Sadly, they did lose both the games against USC this weekend. I believe it was uh, six to three and five to three, if I'm not wrong. Um, but that's why we're hoping the six teams can turn ahead, turn the. Turn a corner here and uh, start getting some goals. As as of now, with 6.20 left, it is still 5 to 1 GSE. And Carl oh, is getting some solid pressure here. Stamps a good hit. And for Petty, he's getting inside the red line side of Carl. And he gets. Ubozo tried to hit for Petty, and that is not a smart idea. That kid is a thick boy. And he's going to get a retaliation penalty, I believe. I don't think Aiden's getting in here. Yeah, GSE will be getting a penalty here. Number 16. Sorry, drop my little GSE's name plate. Mr. John Bradley Heinz. He's in the penalty box for two minutes for nothing. As uh, THA goes on the power play here again. We need a goal here. Need some shots on net. Miles keeps it in back and forth between the D. Goes in front. Pucks loose. And GSE tries to clear, but Derek Pedersen will keep it in. Good fake shot. Got the defender. Apparently turned around and then just kind of whipped on it. Your for GSE will bring it in. Hit by Miles Eddie and instantly turned over. Marco now will bring it in for Tahoe. Take the shot, goes just a tad wide. This game is definitely a lot more chippy than yesterday. A lot bigger hits, way more hits. And the refs are letting him fall. I do believe Mr. Alders is used to the junior game that just happened. The Lakers did just play. Finish there, we done off. And. Sadly, didn't end on such a great note, but the boys played well, and everybody that came had a good time. Beer Gardens was a success. We're uh, having a great time up here for these hockey games. It's always a good time when you're talking up here in Pajo. And I believe this is Dylan in here to take the face off with Marco on his right and Garrett on his left. Lando and Pedersen on defense. DSC is winning these puck battles. Landon gets chipped by. And DSC will take control, take a shot. And a kill will cover, but no whistle. It pops out. And DSC will recover in their own zone. Still chasing behind the goal. And throws it away. So Landon will take a shot from the point. Goes just wide off the tip. Landon driving on the back door. Oh, Garrett saw him too. The guy saw him before Garrett did, but it's a key of being a camera guy. There's be nice in here and doesn't make it, so there will be no icing. Tahoe hopefully regrouped. Patterson with a nice poke through the defender's legs. 
and Landon will do it for Tahoe as DSU poked it away from Patterson. Garrett with a good move up the middle, and they'll go off the middle. As I said earlier, Garrett is one of the only two returners that the 16s have. Him and Mr. Landon Jack. Both of them very nice kids, great kids. Love them both. Very excited that they came back. Excited to see both of them grow as hockey players and into young adults. And face off here, right outside the GSC zone, Dustin wins it. Back to Oliver. And Oliver will regroup in the Tahoe zone, give it across to Petty. And Petty back across to Connor. And Connor trying to get it up out. Doesn't get to poke away. And now Aiden back to Oliver. He's going to chip it up to Dustin, who gets it in. And Connor gets leveled. And they're getting that one. That one's going to be a rough. So as I mean, Connor got rid of the puck there. That's why he got the, pal the penalty. It's basically a free power play if you chip the puck in and then get hit. Um, so Tahoe will be going on the power play here. It's just under four minutes, 3.40 to go. Still 5-1. to one. We got Garrett, Derek, Miles, Dylan, and Marco out there on the power play. Miles is up on the forward spot. And GSC wins the faceoff right away and dumps it in, still some time. Miles with a good stand up behind the net. Makes a toe drag move, makes the defender fall. Two GSC players caught behind the play. As PHA tries to regroup here on the power play. Derek skates it up and out. Gets it by his defender, has a chance. Get it into the glove of the goalie. Get the stoppage down here on the GSE end. Now we just need to take some shots. Lacking on the lacking in the shot department here a little bit. But TSA does still have about a minute 30 on the power play. Dylan wins the faceoff back to Garrett. Garrett will take his time here. Across to Derek. Derek now, again, takes his time. Shot in the Dylan skate. Still has possession. Dylan tries to go across to Marco. Marco's not on the half wall. Garrett will pick it up and go back to Derek in the defensive side. And Derek will go cross ice to Marco, who misses the puck, and GSC will take it. Almost picked it up and out. Good move, Chiefy scores. Derek got toe drag. Sorry about the camera work right there. The GSC did score short handed. Nice little toe drag through the middle. Derek tried to go for the hit, missed, and he went far side on the pillow. Still played absolutely amazing yesterday. It is a stud. He's still playing amazing. Just getting a little shallow here in a second. Trying to get some, trying, gotta get some offense here for Tahoe. Back in the door. Dustin Jones and Connor Haldren out there on forward for Tahoe. Aiden Petty and Lane Death on defense. Landon now, tries to go across ice, Dustin picks, intercepts it, but he'll still keep possession. No icing on the play. They're still on the power play for 25 seconds. And GSE has a guy sitting up on the blue line, in the PHA blue line, waiting for a pass. He does, but a good chip out to Connor. Uh, 
got slashed by in the play there. Everybody saw it. This is getting a little out of hand here. They're hitting a lot. Tahoe will be on the power play again. He didn't see what he got called for exactly. I'm guessing it will be a rough. A rough or a charge. Oh, we'll go again here on the power play for the rest of the period, unless they score. 130 left here in the second. Oh, down 6-1. to one. DSE had four in this period, so it's not like we couldn't get two back here soon. Now Miles will regroup here for Paolo. Tries to get out to Marco. And just barely misses it. And now Derek will pick it up in center ice. Derek Patterson scoops down to Marco. Marco will reset down in the corner. Hard pressure down in the corner by GSE. Dalen Cole hops in there. Fish out the puck. Got three THA players down there in the corner. GSE with another block shot and another opportunity. Oh, man. Takes a shot, good save by Atoa. And now we're going back out. Intercepted Garrett Waterhouse. Good stick save by the game. Got it with the butt end there, but he got it. Just enough to get it wide. Tahoe's got another minute and six seconds on the power play. Marco with a good battle behind the net. Wins it, keeps the puck. Tries to cycle it down to Garrett and just doesn't get it there. Miles now in a one-on-one -on -one and wins it. Pokes it away to Derek and now T.A. Trey will do it. Miles now skates it all the way up himself. Tries to get it across to the middle and no one's there for him. His head is in a foot race here with number 13. Good battle there and that is the end of the second story. So after two, GSC is up six to one. And we will take a short break and we will be back for the third period in about 15 minutes. Um, and again, please, if you guys have any concerns, questions, comments about the video or audio, please let me know. And we will be back here in a minute. Thank you very much, guys. See you soon.